Hey, this is Greg Facetti. We're here at JTEC. We're going to be going through some uh, hydraulic systems today and what we're really going to use to check out how to test a hydraulic pump and explain a hydraulic system is the power steering system on this semi. The pump is buried down here inside the engine bay and the frame rails. We're not going to dig down to it. We've already got our tester hooked up, but before we start testing the hydraulic pump, on this power steering system we're going to kind of explain how this one works basically we have a pump that helps circulate the hydraulic fluid in this open system it's open because we do have a reservoir here it's not a closed loop and while we're circulating that fluid what we're doing is we're power assisting a worm gear uh, cylinder so when we do actually start to give it some input from the steer shaft right there the worm gear will turn and what will happen is we have hydraulic assist to be able to help push that worm gear one way or another based upon the input that we give there. It will open the valves, it will allow uh, hydraulic fluid to flow through and help assist us. And then, you know, we're turning the rest of the steering linkage with that. When we get to a certain point, we do have a safety uh, called a poppet that will go off once we reach full lock and still allow the fluid to circulate. Um, and while we have zero input, such as in this situation with our tires straight and uh, nothing going into the worm gear, then we actually do have a bypass that allows the fluid to keep circulating and keep cooling inside of our reservoir. So here in just a minute, what we're gonna do is we're gonna fire the truck up and we're gonna start flow testing and uh, pressure testing our pump. And basically what that means is we're gonna first start it up get the fluid warm and then we're gonna check to see what our gallon per minute flow is and kind of benchmark that against uh, the spec typically on these systems we want to see about uh, three and a half gallons per minute flow on a power steering system and then what we'll do is we'll start to wind in some back pressure against the system basically like introducing a load and what we'll do is we'll see the uh, flow what it drops to and then we'll also check what our inlet temperature is versus our outlet temperature and we don't want to see a really large uh, increase in the inlet temperature but we do want to see some so we'll get the truck fired up and we'll show you how that's done here in just a second all right so as you can see we're showing about three and a half gallons per minute flow which is great we're at just above absolute zero pressure which is fine We're going to check our temperatures here. So right now the system's still a little cool. So we're going to check it in just a moment. Alright, so now if you can read that flow meter, we're showing about 3.5 gallons per minute. Again, zero pressure. So we're going to take our inlet temp. We're about 122 versus our outlet temp. We're reading about 82. Seems pretty good right now. So we're going to wind in some back pressure, which is basically like load to the system. So we're at 1,000 PSI. Basically, it's a restriction. We're still showing about 3 gallons per minute flow. And not very much of a temperature differential anymore. We did come up about 85, 90 degrees on our outlet. It's because of the restriction that we've introduced. restriction or low on this cylinder and we're showing still two gallons per minute flow right now so I'm going to take the temperature I'm seeing a really really minor increase so we're cooling effectively our pump is flowing well we may as well wind it on out to the cutout As you can see, we've cut out. There is no longer any flow. We're just 
Summit 2000 PSI, which is great for a power steering system. So we're going to back the restriction out, and we're going to go ahead and shut this one off. We're going to call it good. So again, thanks for coming. Thanks for watching my videos. We'll see you later. Peace. 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 Peace.